This is Jennifer Ligori interviewing Codename Zebra for Phonetics Project. Assigned codename is Zebra. Age is 55. The city from is Brooklyn, New York. Language is spoken? English. How long are you in your current city? Well, I moved from Brooklyn, New York to, to New Jersey in 1991. I'm residing in Brick, New Jersey since 2000. Occupation? Electronics engineer. All right, read the paragraph. Limpy. Limpy is a fuzzy yellow baby duck. He belongs to a fisherman. The fisherman lives in a little house by the bay. Every morning, children go swimming in the bay. About 10 o'clock, Limpy waddles out to the road to wait for the children. When he hears them coming, he begins a loud, exciting quacking. The children always bring bread or corn for Limpy. He will nip at their fingers or peck at their bare toes until he is fed. Limpy never follows the children down to the shore. He likes to swim in his own little pond. It is much safer. All right, now I have some questions. Mm -hmm. How well do you think you fit in your social and professional worlds? Rate from 1 to 10. I feel I fit in rather well, somewhere between an 8 and a 10. All right. What kinds of things did you start doing to fit in if you felt you didn't fit in? What about now? Well, in terms of my accent, my New York accent, I would try to enunciate better or sometimes I would talk a little slower if I was talking to people from South, like South Jersey or the South, Southern United States or people in foreign countries. Do you think you have an accent? How would you describe your accent? I would think I have a, a New York accent, but not a heavy one I compared to people I grew up with. After living in New Jersey since 1981, I think I've lost some of my accent, but some people would disagree. Does it bother you if someone asks where you are from after first hearing you speak? It does in a way, because sometimes I feel they're being judgmental and right away you sound different and they're pointing out a difference. You know, I mean, it's, it's almost, it's, it's like a, almost racist in a way, because, uh, I know they want to make fun of the way I talk. It's the first thing they say is, well, you're from New York, aren't you? And, you know, to me, the people from other regions, they sound funny too. But I, I just realized that we're all different and regional accents are just something that occurs naturally. Can you remember when you first noticed you sounded different? What were your struggles around it then and now? I didn't really notice growing up in Brooklyn and I, I was working in New Jersey in 1981. I began working in New Jersey and it really wasn't until then that I, you know, would, would hear stuff from my colleagues about how I, you know, my accent and I would make fun of their accents and we would go back and forth. And I've never really tried to change, but I just think it diminished over the years, not, you know, just by progression. Do you find there are advantages or benefits you experience as a result of an accent? I guess the only benefit I could see is that it's made me more uh, understanding and uh, of other people's accents and more considerate of trying to uh, you know understand them and not to make fun of them. Do you ever feel like you're being judged because of any apparent accent? Yes, I think the fact that I'm an Italian American and I have a Brooklyn accent, people automatically make certain assumptions. And without knowing anything about my upbringing or my educational background. Are you completely content with speaking of someone of an accent or have you considered making changes to your accent? I haven't deliberately tried to change it. The only, time, the only times I'll make an attempt to change is if I feel uh, I'm dealing with a culture that speaks very slow. And New Yorkers tend to speak very fast, so I'll slow it down a bit. Is there anything you wish people knew about you before they heard your accent or judged you from your accent? No, I'm very comfortable with myself you know, and my career, and I'm, I don't really care what they, what they know about. They can judge me from my capabilities. All right, that is the completion of the interview. Thank you very much.